The American Lung Association Airways Clinical Research Centers have conducted over a dozen major lung clinical trials. And this network allows us to perform studies across multiple sites across the United States to study the treatment of airway diseases, specifically asthma, chronic obstructive lung disease, or what we call COPD. One of the advantages of having a network of 17 centers doing clinical trials is that we have the ability to recruit different type of patient population. By studying things um, in diverse populations across the entire United States, we can be really sure that we are investigating things and figuring out whether they're going to be effective uh, in our entire population. We have the expertise of different centers pulled together so that uh, if we design a clinical trial, we can find someone in one of these centers that have done uh, things related. We have individuals who are experts in molecular biology, pharmacology, epidemiology, behavioral medicine, so that we can make use of these people's expertise in order to develop uh, and conduct our research studies. I think one of the most exciting ones recently was where we looked at the safety of the flu vaccine. At the time we did the study, very few people with asthma were getting the vaccine because they were afraid that it made their asthma worse. So we actually conducted a large randomized study and we definitively proved that the flu vaccine does not make asthma worse. And we've actually seen increases in the number of asthma patients getting the flu vaccine since this study came out. The Airways Clinical Research Center Network has been funded from the American Lung Association for almost 20 years. The American Lung Association funding is vital to our existence as a network. It funds the day-to-day -day activity of the centers. The American Lung Association has been absolutely critical to the success of this network. I'm excited about the, the future of the network and how we can potentially address those problems for my patients.